Vicky asks, do you understand what goes throughout Hilly's mind during a game? Because sometimes he says he is sick and also five had ideas, but even his team doesn't understand them. Or is it just not possible to understand the mega mind? In the beginning, yeah. Like in, in like last year, I was like, yo, uh, Hilly, wh- wh- what's, what's, what's going on here? Wh- what were you thinking? And in that pursuit of, of knowledge, and assuming the best out of a player that has the pedigree of Hillisang being, you know, one of the greatest players that has ever played the game. Through the element of me wanting to learn uh, what his thought process was, I have begun to understand how he plays, right? This is a man that plays on the edge and sometimes, you know, you fall off. But most high-level supports play on the edge and sometimes they fall off. Same for Mickey, right? Mickey, sometimes, oh shit, he dies randomly here. Maybe on the surface it looks bad. But there's a lot of thought that goes behind it, you know? Same for supports internationally, right? Fucking Barry L when he won Damon, like when he won Worlds. There are many moments where you like look at it, look like from from just first glance, it's like, yo, what the fuck is he doing? And at the same time, the level of efficiency there is in each game that they play is is insane so all in all it's very easy to say oh this guy died haha he's an inter but to to understand and learn the thought process behind it this is where the community and and you uh, can become a better player a better support and I can tell you guys, Hilly Sang is fucking brilliant. Really, really bl- brilliant. <laughs>